I'd be nice to say a few words in praise of Robert Elsie. I feel something a little odd about this, standing in an Albanian <coughs> embassy, speaking in praise of Robert Elsie, is a little bit like standing in a Catholic cathedral praising the Pope. <laughs> I, was going to, I was going to say God, but I'm happy. <laughs> but <laughs> I, I, I decided to resist all temptation to exaggerate. <laughs> um, because Robert's contribution to Albanian studies of all kinds is, is simply in a class of its own. As I'm sure you know, he is a linguist, by which I don't just mean that he knows languages, which he certainly does, but that he studied the very technical science of linguistics, and indeed has made very technical contributions to the study of Albanian, the Albanian language. Uh, he's a, a tremendous translator, the leading translator in the world out of Albanian, uh, and he has translated an enormous corpus of materials, uh, early historic documents in the Albanian language, literature from many periods, some of the greatest and most difficult things to translate, notably Fichte's uh, Mountain Lut, Haute Matis, uh, but many modern poets, contemporary poets, and he is a world authority on the literature of the Albanian lands. Uh, and I'm sure many of you know his two monumental volumes, The History of Albanian Literature. Nobody had done anything like that before. For people living within Albania, it would have been difficult. Uh, in the communist period, impossible. Uh, but nobody inside the Albanian lands or outside had ever done something on this scale so accurately and with such authority. 